Most people think Botox is for wrinkles. As a physical medicine and rehabilitation doctor, I use it to help people walk, open their hands, and live with less pain. Children with cerebral palsy and adults after strokes or brain injuries often have spasticity, which is muscles that are constantly tight and overactive. Muscles lock up, movement becomes painful, and basic tasks become exhausting. Here's how Botox works for this. It temporarily relaxes overactive muscles by blocking the nerve signals that cause constant contraction. This gives a window, usually three to four months, where movement is easier and physical therapy can actually be effective. During that window, therapists can retrain movement patterns, build strength in opposing muscles, and sometimes unlock long-term gains in function and independence. You're not just relaxing the muscle, you're creating an opportunity to rewire movement patterns while the muscle isn't fighting you. Combined with therapy, those gains can persist even after the Botox wears off. Botox gets attention for wrinkles, but in rehabilitation medicine, it's giving people back their independence. Same molecule, but completely different mission.